Alright everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we're playing some Lee Sin in the jungle and we're running Electrocute, Sun Impact, Eyeball, Treasure, Triumph, and Alacrity. We are going to go Lethality Lee Sin. And we're going to do a lot of damage with Electrocute. Ah, oh, they warded my red. Who did that? The mid laner did. I could still maybe gank topple too. I was going to do a... Wait, why can I still see this? That's weird. But yeah, Electrocute is going to do some insane damage on Lee because it procs instantly. Combined with my lethality items. I think last time I did lethality, I even ran Conquer, which is good too, but... I'll see. Alright, I'm going to try and pull this gank off still. I wonder if I should get the W over the E. I think I might need the W just to like get closer to him. Oh, he's done. Well, he got Janna, but it's fine. We'll take it. I think I can do this camp, but I can't do my chickens because Nocturne might go to my blue. For first item, we can do the Lethality Hydra, or I want to try and do Hubris. And stack up a ton of AD this game. I think I'm going to go straight to my blue here. He might take it from me. If he's there, I don't think I can contest because he's going to be level 3. Okay, he's not here. That's good. Nocturne usually full clears, but he definitely can invade. He's stronger than me early. I can go for this crab. Actually, you know what? Nocturne probably started his uh, red, and he's topside right now. I will test the limits of my divinity. A little bit of a funky clear path I've got going, but we did get that level 2 gank kill, which is good. And Lee Sin, all you got to do is just use an ability after every two auto attacks and you have increased attack speed. Ooh, Briar dies and blames the Janna top. Classic move. Janna top's actually fine. If anything, my chickens might be gone. I'll go try and gank top again, though, because he flashed. Alright, the top crab definitely has to be gone. I'm not going to go check that. Oh, If she goes in, I'll go in, but I can't go in first if she's full. Do need to reset too. Oh, we can kill him. I need him to queue in again. He's gonna do it. Oh, I miss. It's fine. John is fast and he's slow. Nice. I'll help her push. Let's get out of here. I mean, the Tiamat will help me clear a lot faster, but Hubris will get me a lot more damage. So let's try the Hubris. Alright, that's a lot of damage. Nocturne's up. 
a level on me and a lot of CS. If I clear one camp, I think I'm the same level as him. We'll see. Okay, I can't even contest Grub Cinder's there. He's gonna be almost level six. Full clearing is a lot better than ganking in this meta. He's gonna get that crab too. Oh, that's not good synergy. Yeah, it sucks. Nocturne gets a huge advantage by full clearing. He gets a whole level ahead of me, even though I got two kills off ganks. But I guess full clear meta still it. I might hit six off this big wave, though. He could go to my red. An enemy has been slain. Let them come. Has been slain. Bot lane, I think, is my next gank spot. Really didn't think Nocturne would go way top still. A thousand battles, a thousand victories. I think she's got her. Oh, maybe not. I'm coming. Oh, never mind. She's got it. I got it. Need the treasure. Okay. If I can get some kills bot lane, stack up the treasure, that'd be good. Ooh, we gotta go fight this. I hate to give him everything, but... Briar TP'd. Oh, I didn't think she knew I was there. I don't have a ward. Oh, perfect timing on that. I think I can get more. Yep. Another one. Ah, there we go. There's the snowball effect. There, what are you doing? Probably gonna die to Nocturne here. Or not. Oh, I might need to help this. Yeah. Good thing I backed off that a little early. This is red up. Oh, Nocturne didn't die. Still yoinked his red. He has no ult. I need to go by Hubris. Wow. What a loser you are, Syndra. Might come to me like this too. She really ran all the way down the river to take that. Yeah. Alright, let me go by. He's gonna be on grubs. This will do. Who am I going next? Ooh, opportunity gives so much damage. Mortal trinkets. 
I don't know if we can do anything though. We've already got the buff, so it doesn't matter. There's a pink in my jungle. Okay, that guy's low. That guy is just straight up gone. I erased him. Oh my damage! I saw your mistakes all too clearly. Exploded. Watch Sintra come back. Nah. Straight up exploded them. Okay, I have insane damage. Those are gone. Wish I had ult, but I don't think she has ult. Oh, I don't have a ward. She knows I'm here too. Okay, I flashed over it, but cool beans. That is like next level unlucky. And there's no red buff to burn her. He's gonna go take my bot side. Whatever. I'll need an Edge of Night next for sure. I expect nothing but perfection. The same farm as him. Friar's gonna die here. Oh wow. He lived. Yeah, there's definitely a lot of wards in my jungle. Syndra and Nocturne are really playing to keep vision on me. It's really hard for me to do anything to Syndra. She's just gonna eat me away. Done. I mean, I go in here, I get Nocturne ulted. Oh, she's dead. Good Briar ult. I'd rather take this than Dragon. Just because he's got all the grubs. But I'm gonna get probably attacked by Yone and Nocturne, of course. Well, we got the dragon. Maybe they can get here in time. That was crazy. I kicked Yone into Nocturne. <laughs> and I killed him. I, I autoed him while he was uh, flying back to his E. I didn't think I'd be able to get him. Why did we have vision of that ward? Is that like a bug or something? I don't think anybody swept it. Alright, I guess you can have it. I will this world. Yeah, I definitely need Edge of Night. If I die versus Nocturne, he gets so far ahead. Spell Shield saves me versus Syndra.
They do have shields. I could go Serpent's Fang. This might not be good. I can wait here. Nocturne might come ult bot. Yeah, he's definitely gonna ult here. Unless they know I'm in here. Oh, Nocturne's top side now. They will tremble in awe. They missed. Oh my god, I'm terrible. Ah, the stupid shield's already up. I don't care. Me? That was scary. If I died to Nocturne there, he gets like a full item. I don't want to die to Yone either. That champion's scary. I'm pretty big though. A three hundred. Maybe his top side's up. I'm very speedy. That's not up. That's not up. Are you serious? I see. Is there anything for me? Nothing. An arrow. An ally has been slain. I don't even need to land the Q. Normally on Lee you need to land the Q to do like so much damage. But I just land electric Q and they're dead. Oh, they really gave up. That sucks. I mean, still a fun game. Really didn't think they were at a point to give up there. They're not even that close to losing. Alright, we did 15k damage in 19 minutes. Here's our rune stats. 9, 10 on Electrocute. I mean, it actually did better than Conquer for this game. Because of all the burst I had. Alright, we got some Kennen ARAM. It's actually really, really fun and strong on ARAM. If you get the right comp, they don't have too many tanks. Nasus is going to be very hard to kill unless he goes AP. But I can one-shot these three once I get bad enough. So, we could do, like, Rocket Belt first, I guess. Zoom in, zap them. I wonder how malignants would be on cannon. I know the mana is kind of wasted, but lowering all their MR on the alts and it would create a bunch of zones could work. I think I just go full AP, try to one shot. Level 6 is when it's playable for me. And then I'm my team's engage. Oh my god, we have three ADCs. Ooh, an Oriana though. If she puts a ball on me when I go in, we can like get a wombo. I'm dead. He got healed, unfortunately.
Hourglass is really good too, so I don't get blown up when I'm alting. I don't think they really... Actually, Vagar could burst me. We do have a, an Akshan too, so we can get revived. I'm gonna be level six here, but I might wait till I die so I have full health and a rocket belt so I could land the alt a little bit better. Now Swain does get a lot of health, but in this mode I think he takes like 10% more damage, so it takes him a while to scale. Nice, I got a kill. Storm Surge is good too. Let's do it. I think we just go Death Cap next. There we go. Power of a cannon alt in ARAM. Nice. Quadra. I didn't even die. Wow. Oh, I didn't get the cannon. See if I can get somebody to run in too far and die for me. If I hit that Q, I would have killed him. Um, I would get Sork Shoes. I can actually wait for Sork Shoes here too. I don't have ult up anyway. Damn, dude, that would have been a penta if the Nasus didn't flash away. <laughs> that would have been an instant penta. We're all range champs, so Nasus actually doesn't really get to play. Oh, I'm getting huge. winning. Oh my damage. All right. Well, <laughs> I'm going to be a big cannon. All right. I have ult again, but I need to just die. Alright, we got death cap. Now I do double damage. Nasus is getting MR, Swain's getting some... He's probably going Spirit next, I feel. I don't know. Nice. 
Nice. I didn't get the greatest ult there. They all kind of split up. <laughs> I can wait for ult. I have enough HP. Health pack's almost up. Yeah, he is going spirit. They're stacking MR now. I mean, we have three AD champs. I gotta go void next, I think. I can't ult him now. If I flash in and get big or ulted, I just die. He just wait out his ult, but we can kill him too, I guess. Can you go for backline? Backline has no MR, frontline's stacking MR. I think we can do Shadow Flame. Shadow Flame, then Void or Hourglass. Get the health pack, Jinx. Nice, we got the res. Gotcha. I'll let his ult time out. Spirit Mercs. Trying to heal this guy. I can kill Velkaz in three spells. We need a void. I mean, my team can deal with Nasus and Swain as long as I kill these three, and I can always kill these three. They're not building MR. Even if they did build MR, I'd still kill them.
They're trying to burn everything on me, though. I'm almost level 16. All right, the wither's down. So is Vagar. How are all these gin traps here? Isn't there still a gin? And now there's not. Oh, he has 500 stacks? He must just give him stacks, because he's not, like, doing minions. I don't think he is. They're not really letting me ult anymore. They're keeping the front line really far up and the back line just hides so far away. If I flash, I can get them. I'm not going to do it here, though. I'm going to say flash for a fight where I can get a juicy ult. This is getting kind of scary though, only building tank items. But Kennen just got a void. Banshees or Hourglass? Banshees would stop me getting withered every time. But there are a lot of spells that could pop it. I just buy a blue pot here in flash alt. Oh, no. Really? Insta killed from teleport. I didn't even get to move. Oh well. Ooh, we're gonna lose any here. That's really bad. My ADCs are not doing their jobs. Kind of a 1v5, I'm not gonna lie. The power of tanks and ARAM, though. guys yeah I don't think we can kill Nasus at this point GG it was funny Ram but unfortunately we got no teammates and they got five teammates they just build pure tank and do more damage than us If only one of my AD carries did damage to him. But none of them built armor pen. They built lethality. No LDR. That was fun though. I got a lot of kills.
But yeah, straight up 1v5. Let's see the damage. Yeah, I see. They didn't do anything. Well, GG, if you guys enjoyed Lee Sin and Aram Cannon, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Peace.